I got a. Hey, Cameron. You know uh, how you talked about cat girls, right? Yeah. Like six seconds ago. Yeah. Well, I got the perfect thing for you on Kickstarter.com oh. slash subvert. Oh. I guess. Oh, yeah, daddy. I don't like where this is going anymore. Just go, thing. Why did you take the remote from me? I didn't mean to take control. I think I couldn't press enter because you took control from me. Ooh. I like that Kickstarter at least converts for me because I don't have to be stupid. Oh, I know what this is. I didn't watch. I, we're going to watch this thing together. Okay. I haven't watched this yet. I just saw it yesterday. Studio that was banned from Patreon. For making a werewolf eat out a girl's butthole. <laughs> and the director of such uh, cinematic classics as Bioshack Trinity. Can we get a move on with this sausage sizzle already? In oh a universe full of alien dickheads, you are a loser of no significance. That's a bit harsh, mate. This is great. I already love it. Take my money. Explore the galaxy. Okay. Give me collect oh, kick ass loot, and finally unlock three different. Colored endings. Winner of absolutely nothing and the recipient of no awards whatsoever. Seriously, <laughs> they wouldn't even let us into GDC to talk about my titty physics. Holding their hand. Yeah, that's holding something. I guess you hold their hand. Oh god damn it! <laughs> <laughs> See, look, the great future Steam has allowed us. Yes, Steam. What they say about Steam? I don't know. Hold on. I'll go back. Do you have Steam? Something about, do you have steam? Yeah, we'll go for it back. What's wrong? Don't you guys have steams? <laughs> yeah, I thought it was a joke after I heard it the second time. What do you, uh, what's wrong? Don't you guys have phones? <laughs> By the way, here's how much they got funded. The, I, I can get behind this Damn. one. I'm, I'm okay with this. I actually thought I, about pledging I, to this after I saw I'm it yesterday. Okay with this. Okay Since the dawn of time, man kind of started at, stared at the cosmos with a mixture of trepidation and wonder, turning our curious eye towards the glittering stars sparkled around our little blue planet. We have often asked ourselves an eternal question. Are we alone in the universe? What is out there? More importantly, can we bone it? So basically it's a porn game, but like a really well-made That's why game. we made Subverse, a tactical RPG, SHMUP hybrid. Shmup hum, hybrid that will take place in a fully explorable universe where you can get to be the captain of your own ship, which is crewed by the sexiest and deadliest waifus you can recruit. Oh, and you can also befriend a per per what? Perpetually stoned imp me mechanic with six tentacles. Testicles. That yeah. fuck. <laughs> I thought you know tentacles made more sense, but you're right. Test and in the prodigy pro prodigy galaxy. Place ruled by a bunch of per, per, what the fuck are these words? Principal, I don't know. Puritanical, oppressive douchebags who pretty much hate anything sexy. Thank you. Naturally, it's up to you to lead a covert revolution to overthrow these dickheads with your very own black ops squad of knockout waifus, backed up by genetically engineered monsters and a top secret stolen military fighter ship, all of which can be upgraded into an unstoppable force with loot and credits. There you go. Just look at that. <clears throat> look at that wiggle. A seminal elite team of deadly alien waifus that will fight for you. Learn this learn back, their learn their backstory, earn their loyalty, and they'll do other stuff for you too. By their stuff, we mean in bed, like you know, copulation, Copu copulation. Fuck, words. Copulation. Copulation. Comp. Top. Sex. You'll fuck them. Don't need that word. <laughs> Just in case it wasn't absolutely clear, you can bang your teammates. Are we good now? Okay. Explore the Prodigium Galaxy with your total baller stealth ship called the Mary. Gil 
Gillestate, whatever, fuck. Millie Celeste. I, know, I can't read. Let's drop a lot of Phoenix. It's okay, a, so it's a top-down shooter. Filled with a memorable with perverts and deviant villains. And discover side quests and complete them for loot and perch upgrades and awesome stuff for your ship, like nudie magazines. Oh, hell yeah. Engage in plot-driven shmup missions if you got a twitchy thumb or tactical grid RPG turn-based combat. For a more nuanced approach involving less flying kamikaze laser dick ships, destroy your enemies with... with the, uh, which includes space pirates, bounty hunters, rogue warriors, pleasure droids, and other assorted scumbags. There you go. There's the tactical stuff. It's like XCOM, oh. kind of. Collect okay, rare so DNA samples across your adventures to create various bioweapon monsters called manticores. Mantic... Man, wait, what? Mantics? Mantics. To fight alongside your waifus. Outside of combat, yeah. your troops can serve <laughs> other purposes by keeping your waifu satisfied. Yes, we totally mean by bagging. Meet the waifus. Meet the waifus. What can we say? We love to entertain, so we decided to pack the burst to the brim with waifus of multiple alien species and organic classifications, all of which were created by world-renowned art director and squid girl, titty enthusiast. Zhong Zhong Ding. Yeah, of course he's like Chinese. Or... That's brain, that's... Fuck you. I'm going to be racist here. Just kidding, I love the Chinese. <laughs> as long as they keep making these games, they're great. Oh, yeah. By degree of the emperor, decree of the emperor, wanted for questioning, <laughs> illegal sex bot, <laughs> consorting with pirates, unlawful cyber. Connor, what? Space whale. Whale well, noise is, is intensified. Black black popular demand. The infamous whales of Studio Fowl will get to pick their ver very own love scene and fetish to be featured as one of the in-game rewards. You will work with our director and lead animator to bring your fantasies to life. Limited slots. Do they? Do they sell out of that? Yeah, it's they, no longer. They sold out. They <laughs> sold out. Brayden. Your ship's loyal man from Android is happy to serve you in every desirable way. She maintains your ship can translate thousands of alien languages in a very bro enough to del delete your embarrassing hollow net searches. Mm. I like that's all by decree of the Empress. Really? Yeah. Because yeah. everyone's woman and women. Everyone woman. woman. Yeah, Lily, woman. renegade doctor. Genetic manipulation. Decent exposure. Indecent exposure. Adult content distribution is the robot. <laughs> a sexy mad scientist on a mission of redemption, Lily is the mastermind behind the Manticore bioweapon program. Just do yourself a favor and don't visit her lab uninvited while she's running endurance tests on her latest creations. Mm. 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 Killison. Pirate warlord. Drug trafficking, of course. Destruction, Destruction of, of Imperium property. property. A disposed pirate crew with a chip on her shoulder and an appetite for want a war wanton destruction. Killison will stop at nothing to get revenge from her mutinous fleet, and if you help out, there just might be some delicious crimson bo booty in it for you. Mm. You got fortune. Cyber criminal hacking database identity theft evading arrest. Oh, no shit. Your spunky hacking prodigy and reluctant partner in espionage hell-bent on taking down the government that relentlessly hunts her. Fortune is an elite black bag wanderkin. Kind? Wonderkin. Wonderkin? Wonderkin. What the fuck is that? With a bratty yeah. attitude, she's a perfect example of the... In Genie to... Fuck. I can't read. I start reading too fast, and I just can't read words anymore. Ingenuity of the Homo sapiens. What? And also a perfect example of why some of the aliens want to goddamn murder us in our sleep. Fucking humans, man. We're too good. Then waifu. Why do you have wanted for questioning waifu? Rumored allies. The cat burglar. The corrupt general. The rogue regent. The bounty hunter. The ex-porn star. Empress Celestian has yet to capture these gorgeous alien individuals. They need your help with various galactic matters. Prove your worth, and they may yet join your crew to become devoted party members. Horse reels. We can hear them talk! Ooh. Let's hear their sexy ass voices. First off, my ass is at least a seven. Second, hacker is a title reserved for losers playing with scripts they barely understand. So, if that's all you think I am, it's clear you didn't learn your lesson the first time. I think you can handle picking up one guy. And I've got a galaxy-wide war campaign to plan, so I'll leave you to it. Check back in with me after Dalek's on board. How about I fly your ship into the nearest sun instead? Because the last time we worked together, you tried to run off with my half of the payload, you unbelievable dick! Mm, I do have a dick for queen. you. Queen! I am Pirate Queen Collision the Red, Supreme Commander of the True Dread Fleet. Don't get too excited. Personally, I think it's more likely you fail. In which case, ever get I'll that feeling? Ever get that feeling? A deja vu. <laughs> I'm sorry. 
<laughs> oh, Captain. If you actually manage to help me take out Tybalt and get that treasure, I'll do a lot more for you than join your team. Ooh. I'm already hard. As a scientist, yep. I believe the preservation of knowledge is essential. <sighs> It's a shame you boys always need to take a break, right when I'm still ready for more. Mind if I tag along, Captain? Considering the odds are stacked against us, you could use an extra hand on the weapon system. Hmm, <laughs> so tell me, should I make a silly examination joke at this point? Or just stuff my panties into your mouth and fuck you? Alright! Oh, okay! <laughs> that was just straight to it! All pirate dickheads have officially been vaporized, Captain. We'll see oh, you back on board the Mary Celeste soon. Actually, Captain, fornicating with a superior officer is indeed against Solar Navy regulations, especially if it's with two at once. Captain, I am detecting elevated levels of stress and anxiety in your voice. With now being an ideal time to showcase the adult portion of this game, I highly suggest you allow me to perform fellatio on you. My uh -oh. anal outlet is equipped with <laughs> different suction settings, along with my... Oh, with my I must admit, killing my arch nemesis, getting rich in the process, does sound like a rather productive use of my time. Still, if I help you, you're gonna have to help me. I am terrified of this woman, and that is so attractive to me! <laughs> you know... <laughs> As horrible as that sounds, I'm finding it difficult to take the threats of someone barely the size of my dick seriously. Am I crazy, or was that an implication of sweet scarlet booty in my near future? Alright. Enjoy a wild ride through the main story arc as you assume the role of a stranded human in a hostile galaxy. Tired of your meaningless existence? You take up arms against your alien overlords as a tale of abs absorbent fuck. Absurdient comedic harem building revolution folds vibrations plot lead to combat plot combat plot or something that vibrates Ooh. They aren't just here to look stand around and look pretty They're here to look pretty and suck my dick Smumps aren't dead motherfuckers Oh, hey, look, there's the space ass or whatever, space tits. Ooh, space titties. Milestones. Oh, what? yeah, what were the milestones? These were, I think, just to fund the game, because the fun game was just 100,000 or whatever. Yeah. Or is this above the base amount? I think this is above the base amount. The chapter game. I oh, know, I think... I. Uh... There's a cat girl, Cameron. We were right. Oh, yes. Nice. There's a hundred th additional animations. Ooh. Ooh, do I see tentacles? For two of all the waifus. And for two for all of the waifus. Animated lewd sequence or two for all of the waifus in the game. Trust us, you're going to want to see these. Squid girl. Ooh. Amphibious alien bounty hunter nemesis that relentlessly stalks you throughout the galaxy. Folks defeat her and she might become whatever tentacle girl. She comes tentacle girl. Base game with 10 chapters! 30 hours of gameplay. Eight recruitable waifus? Anything else we detailed here? Fully voiced acted? Okay. Additional Xeno animations. Loyal loyalty quests. Cinematic waifu vignette. Oh, damn. You had a whole backstory for each waifu. Oh, cool. Oh, uh, you're looking at the cinematic thing? <laughs> God damn it, Cameron. Of course I am. Interactive, sexy. So we will provide one to two minute things. Nice. Customizable quarters, additional animation. Do so much. That's all I need. Just keep saying additional animations. People can keep giving you money. Yes. Fauchan invade. UFOV some succubus secretaries ready to terrorize the fucking galaxy. What is that? Oh, they're gonna make a fucking Cameron. They're gonna make a Dojin. Oh hell yeah! At six hundred fifty thousand, they're gonna make manga stuff or whatever. Oh, they reached their final goal too. War chest. <laughs> they're like basically, if we get a million dollars, we probably can guarantee this. 
Astronomer, Cameron. Fifty dollars. Seventy-five is Big Bang Theorist. Zeno Zookeeper. Studio sixty-nine VP. Curious Colonist. Bow and Bow Weekly Editor. Space Whale. There you go. There's an animation. There's your ship. There's your sex spot. There's your sex spot again. Don't care about any of this. Who cares about merch? I don't need any merch. Mm. How to get the waifus. Gabe got us this far. Might as well stick with Gabe. <laughs> That's my friend. Wise words. I don't I don't need anything. All I know is that I need this game now. Yep. I want it now. Yeah, we do like some Kickstarters. <laughs> We're gonna get hate now. We're we are, we're gonna get hate now. Oh no! I don't care. <laughs>